children now it's time to find out the answers of the questions from the lesson so get ready to find out to read listen and understand so let's read the first question it is asking who is called the bird man of india it is a simple question it is asking about who is called the bird man of india so we will find the answer of this question in the first paragraph of the lesson which says bird watching is a very interesting hobby in the second line it's written one person who made it quite popular was dr selim ali or the bird man of india it means who is called the bird man of india dr selim ali so answer we will write so let's read with me dr selim ali is called the bird man of india now second question which is the tallest bird in india read with me which is the tallest bird in india the answer of this question we will find in the second paragraph of the lesson it's written he gave the world a lot of information about different birds here we are talking about dr selim mali who gave a lot of information about birds to the world now here in the second line it is uh, written it's a question did you know that the tallest bird in india is the sarus crane so here is our answer the tallest bird in india is the sarus crane so read the answer with me The tallest bird in India is the sarus crane. You can see the image of sarus crane on your screen. So this bird is the tallest bird in India. Next question: Which is the largest bird in India? Now we found the tallest bird. Now the largest bird. The answer of this la question is in the, on page number forty-eight. The largest bird in India is the great bustard. The tallest bird Sarus crane in term of height it is the tallest in term of size the largest bird in India is the great bustard. You can see the picture of a uh, great bustard on your screen. So this bird is the largest bird in India. Next question how does a tailor bird build its nest? This question is asking about the tailor bird that how does the tailor bird build its nest wo apna ghonsla kaise banati hai all the birds build their nest so how does the tailor bird build its nest so the answer we'll find on page number 48 where the picture of tailor bird is also there it's written the read with me the tailor bird actually sews together leaves with cobweb threads or fine grass to build its nest so here is the answer all of you read the answer with me the tailor bird sews together sews together it's s e w s is not sews it's sews together leaves with cobweb threads means the tailor bird what it does it stitch the leaves together aapas mein leaves ko wo stitch karti jaise tailor stitch karta hai silta hai similarly your tailor bird stitch the leaves together sews the leaves together with cobweb threads ye jale se stitch karte hai aur fine grass ya fir fine grass patli patli grass se stitch karte hain to build its nest apne nest ko build karne ke liye okay so let's read the tailor bird sews together leaves with cobweb threads or fine grass to build its nest you can see the tailor bird nest on your screen you can see the picture so that's how the tailor bird build its nest now the last question is asking now read the question with me what does a bird use its beak for here we have to write the use of birds beak birds apne beak means choch ko kis liye istemal karte hain that we have to write okay now the answer is there in your book 
On page number 48, it's written a bird uses its beak for eating, fighting and nest building. This is the exact answer. We don't need to change this sentence. So we'll write this. Now read the answer with me. A bird uses its beak. So I T S its likha. Its means unki beak. Just like we, if we are talking about boy or girl, we write his or her. So when we are talking about animals or things, we write its. Okay. So the bird uses its beak for eating fighting and nest building now all of you ha uh, have understood the question answers now it's time to write these question answers neatly in your classwork notebook do this work neatly with proper heading day day cw underline the heading and draw line after every answer the most important thing is to read and write. Please, parents, please ensure that child will read while writing.